gold fever. We all know the phenomenon: an obsession, a never-ending fascination, and a desperate need for more. As I read this book, Cain and Abel, I experienced something similar: reading fever. The thing that matters most is that the timing of most events breathes a new zeal in the theme of the book in various parts. Originally taking place between the two world wars, Acas historical with throughout each chapter pulled me away. The events like Titanic's sinking, an economic recession in 1929, slave markets in the Middle East, battles of the company board of directors, and even wars in Vietnam emerged sequentially throughout the storyline. The blogs basically about the whole life of two illustrious men, but they had nothing in common, but was born on the same day. Their backgrounds are also different. One was born in Poland, and his mother died immediately after, and the other was born in the USA, with his father being a bank manager. Each of them is developed from birth by the author, and he does an outstanding job of taking you. Through the childhood, teenage school years, and then adulthood, so as a reader, you really get a feel for what they are made of, and why they made the decision throughout their life. You end up liking both characters despite them conflicting with each other. The writing is so vivid, and the story was so gripping. There are so many subtle twists and turns to the plot. The ending is remarkable when you realize that money can't buy you happiness. Yet the story is simply about humans' emotions. I don't want to talk too much about the plot, as I want you to go and discover it yourself. But I must warn you that this book is blockbusting, and once you read it, you can't put it down.